Hello, this is Cass Baloo, and welcome to Mega Man Battle Network! I've been looking forward to this. Ah. Uh, but not enough to remember what buttons are which. Admittedly, it's been a while since I've used this controller configuration. Len, wake up! If you don't get up, you'll be late for school! Pet news! Pet net news! WWW crime is on the rise! It says the W3 plan to control the net! No, I didn't miss a word there. Uh, it says the... The... W3 plan to control the net might be starting. I missed the the. It was evidently an important the. Sleep. You've got mail from Dad, too. Look. Sorry. Oh, I guess this is his mother. Sorry I couldn't get off work Sunday. I'll be home soon. Here's a present for you, it says. There's some battleship data attached. Okie dokie. Sci fi mom, I'll go to school. Lana, Lana's hidden some test answers in this bookshelf. Hope that mom doesn't find it. So, this is Mega Man Battle Network! This is a game that I played a lot growing up. <clears throat> or more specifically, the sequels to this game I played a lot growing up. I did play this one a little bit as well, but not nearly so much as the, say, 3 to 5 range. Those are the ones that I really dove into full force. So, uh, let's, uh, we got our pet, P.E.T. Um, personal electronic terminal? Link on AI navigation program. Megaman.exe! Lan, good morning. If you need to talk to me, just push the L button. How convenient. I suppose this is a handheld terminal, so it may very well have an L button. Okay, but first... Hurry! Let's go to school! Sigh, if we have to... Len's secret tools are hidden here. Sorry, couldn't get off work Sunday. I'll be home soon. Here's a present for you. Use it well. Link got a cheap chip for cross gun. See, W3 crime is on the rise. W3's plan to control the net might be starting. Okay, so that chip. Uh, not exactly what I was looking for. We have a folder here. When we get in a battle, we will get. A, we can do a few different things. We, which uh. Uh, we can move around a field. Well, then you know, we'll worry about the particulars later. The important part for what I'm explaining is what is that we'll have a random selection of five of the 30 chips in this folder, and we use them to do different attacks. The letters are important because you can only pick chips that have the same letter or the same name. So we can pick cannon A and cannon B, and we can use them on the same turn. But we cannot pick, um, or let, let's see if there's a good example. Uh, we can also pick Recover 10A and Cannon A on the same turn. But we cannot pick Cannon B and Recover 10A on the same turn. And different chips do different things. Plus, we can also attack using our Mega Buster, but, well, whatever. That's boring. It is boring, I say. Um, so. 
What I'm going to be trying to do is learn which button is the correct button to hit, but also, I want, because of the way that works, it is better to have fewer uh, chip uh, IDs, I guess you could call them, in your folder. The fewer there are, the more uh, attack combinations you'll be able to use, basically. Let's look at what else is in here while we're here. This is my status. 100 HP, level 1, and 1 in every in all the stats. Plus, no armor. So, you know, that could be better. And it will be, but not right now. Lands Terminal Program Mega Man EXE is installed. Uh... Right. This is just for the wireless communications, which obviously I cannot do for this. Kind of unfortunate. Your PC, if you jack in here... Oh, I forgot about that! That ter terminology. You can send Mega Man into the net. You wanna jack in? Let's do it after school! <laughs> oh, the joke writes itself. But that's very important. We use that to go online with Mega Man, basically to swap between playing as to be playing as Mega Man instead of Lan here. This panel controls all of the electric items in the household. This TV is too old to have a jack-in port. A very attractive stand, chosen of course by Mom. Mom loves to collect all of these plates. Man, if you thought I was bad in Golden Sun. Actually, I really toned it back in Golden Sun. Uh. Oh hey, we gotta recover. For eating breakfast. Cool. Something in this pot smells really good! Yum! The pies that Mom makes in this oven are the best! The refrigerator is filled with food. Good morning, lad. Breakfast is on the table. You have time to eat, right? Actually... Uh... Does L combine with anything? Uh, it combines with X panel. And mini bomb. Hmm. Yeah, okay. A simple touch like this vase really cheers up the place. Rot row. Mail looks grumpy. No one asked you to wait for me. Mm -hmm. Did you just say something? Come on, let's go! Why do we always have to walk to school together? Jeez, I mean, come on, what are you, my mom? Wow, lad, that is not cool. Oven incidents, you say? People's ovens have been spitting fire at them. Wow. Well, that doesn't sound good. Another W3 virus. That's like it's scrolling quite fast. At least it is for the auto scroll. Uh, there's no configuration options though, so yeah. <laughs> that face. <laughs> Morning, Lan. Dex was looking for you. He's too big to be in elementary school, you know? Kinda scary. The blackboard is covered with Nixon graffiti. These books are all by Miss Mary's favorite author. Dr. Yasu's Guide to Virus Busting. Looks interesting. The teacher's desk. There's no chair. I mean, there are adventures and disadvantages to that, I suppose. I mean, the Western system, this, this simply wouldn't fly, because usually the teacher, teacher's classroom, well, maybe not usually, but often, their classroom doubles as their office. Although that's less so in... so now than it may have once been. 
it makes a lot of sense of the Japanese school system, though, where um, the teachers come, the students are always stay in the same room, and the teachers come to it. So, I mean, I don't think that's even applicable to an elementary school anyway, and I'm pretty sure Lan is an elementary school. But so your math teacher comes here, then your homework teacher comes here, then your science teacher comes here, and so on and so forth. Everything is in the same room, and you have different teachers coming to you in it. Um, so they have their own office, like, probably in some faculty lounge. A anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. You... No, I can't do it. I just... Oh, I... <laughs> sure. P.E.T. Short for pers- Is that it? I mean, I got- I knew the personal terminal part. I thought E was maybe its own letter. But it gotta have those acronyms, I suppose. I mean... Yeah, I would definitely just abbreviate it as a P.T. Probably, but whatever. Kinda like a cell phone that does a whole lot more. Except it's not really like a cell phone because it only- it doesn't connect directly- well, no, it must connect to the internet directly, because you get email on it. But at the same time, you can't actually do anything cool with it unless you plug in directly. Hmm. Whatever. You can send mail, use electronic money, or read textbooks! The Navi program inside helps, you ha helps if you have a problem, too. Indeed. A class notebook. Handwriting this bad must be Dex. A cleanup schedule. I hope I don't get back in duty. Studying ants. There's nothing here. Wait! There's a weird bug crawling in the dirt. Hmm. That frog in the cage is looking at me. It's so creepy. And I was like, for real? Yeah, dog, you don't even know. Okay, so I guess that's not just a rumor. Well, I mean, I guess it depends what you mean by rumor. Len, you hear about the World 3's plan to control the net, right? Yes. Yes, I definitely read that email. Talk about scary! I mean, what are we supposed to do? I mean, we are like, what, fifth graders? That's a random guess, but let's go with fifth graders. I've been waiting for you, Lan. I challenge you to a net battle! Door would be Mega Man against my Guts Man! Guts! Hmm, no, let's, let's, what? Oh, no, class started. Nope, guess we'll have to, guess we'll have to battle some other time. Oh, I will be. No, I'm pretty sure this is the tutorial now. Unfortunately, we cannot skip it. Uh... It's a good- it's a well enough way to integrate it into the game, I suppose. But it's kind of annoying. Because, well, frankly, it's slow. It's important that we all know how to fight viruses. You know, it's kind of odd that the teacher of all people doesn't have her own Navi. Or at least she doesn't have a custom one. Because most of the custom... Usually it's a... Well, I mean generally in a game like this, if someone has a custom sprite, it's a pretty good clue that they're going to be important. But more generally, usually if they have a custom sprite, they have their own net Navi. I don't think the teacher does though. At least not in this game. Hmm. Well, whatever. Yep. Yeah. 
Spacey. And all the navvies are at. Yeah, case in point. Hers is purple, but is clearly a generic navvy. Whereas, you can see Mega Man here, as well as the navvies of some of his friends. You can probably guess who they are based on how they look like if you... Whether, if you're familiar with Mega Man at all. But, well, we'll see soon enough anyway. Yeah, I know how this works, okay? Hmm. You know, I can probably hit both. Well, hmm. I kind of want to do something fancy. But, yeah, it wants me to use the cannons. I know how it works! I do not, however, remember the button for using these chips. I think it's just one is for the Mega... I think just A is for the Mega Buster and B is for the chips, or vice versa. Okay, yeah. A is for the chips. Great! I know how it works! Look, I don't want to waste a cannon by mashing buttons, so... We win! Okay, yeah, I know... I know how bloody works. Blah, blah, blah. Steel, for short. Also known as Area Steel, plus Sword. Specifically, Wide Sword. You can probably guess what makes it wide. Again, I know how it works! Stop micromanaging me! Now, if you hit an enemy- if an enemy is in the area where you do that, uh, I cannot charge my Mega Buster. It will deal 10 damage to them, but you will not steal the area from them. Incidentally, as you can see, you can fire the Mega Buster more quickly if you're closer to your target. That's actually ver something very useful to know. Although, it's not really very relevant if you're charging up. Unfortunately, I can't actually do that right now. For some reason. A little bit annoying. Yeah, I know how it works. Mm hmm. Okay, so... If we use this next turn, this second row will be filled with chips. Then if we do it a second time, we'll get the row after that as well. However, um... Actually, I don't remember whether... Those extra rows may or may not go away when you actually use your chips. I'm not entirely sure, because I don't remember. I know it's different from game to game. Uh, in any case... Can I... No? Okay, I hope that's just a tutorial, otherwise I'm gonna need to mess around with my controls. Because I am going to need to be able to charge my damn gun at some point. We did it! Woo! Hmm, uh, no. No, I do not. What I do want to do is BATTLE! Let's do it. Lose? HA! I'm gonna kick your ass! Uh, having said that, the thing to watch out from Gutsman here... Uh, well, first of all, most navvies move around randomly like that. Uh, I seriously can't charge my gun. But, uh, what was the thing? Right, the thing to watch out from Gutsman here is, uh, he does that. But, we can take advantage of it. Because his attack only hits, um... He has one short-range attack if you get, like, right up in front of him. But for the most part, he only does the shockwaves. Uh, I wasted my damn guns. Well, I'm a stupid. Okay then. Good to know! Good to know that I am a stupid.
And mm. my- yeah, he does that as well, which can be a little annoying. But again, not that dangerous if you are clever about where you stand. Mini Bomb is a little bit different. It'll always... It's... it's honestly, it's not a very good weapon. It's slow, and it always hits three squares ahead of you. We're probably going to be trying to get rid of our Mini Bomb sooner rather than later. Uh, yeah, he does that. If you're right up next to, in front of him, he will try to punch you. Honestly, though, Gutsman is probably one of the easiest bosses in the game. Well, I say bosses. One of the easiest Navi fights in the game. It might even be a little bit generous to be calling him a boss in the first place. I probably didn't get a good. Oh, it didn't even. It didn't even grade me. Hmm. Yeah, I definitely just got lucky. You're just bad, dude. You're bad, and you should feel bad. Uh, yeah. On that note, I think I'll stop up here. Join me next time when we dive into the net! And do other- and do other fun stuff. Like battle! More battle. Battle's always good. Battle is life! Uh, and this has been Mega Man. Uh, having said that, before I go, by once per- it is time for my once per LP, um, shilling, I guess you could say. This is the first episode of the LP, so this is the best time to remind people, uh, that please leave... Actually, you know what? No, I don't even care if you like the video. If you do, great, but I don't feel compelled to do so. I, what I do care about is if you leave comments. Please leave comments. I love to read and I love to read the comments that people leave in my videos and respond to them. It is like one of my favorite parts of doing this sort of thing is being able to get that sort of engagement. So yeah, please, and you know it can't d doesn't really hurt for having more people see the video either. But no, really, I just want people to talk to about the games that I'm playing. So you know that'd be nice. In any case, in any case, that's the only time you're going to he hear from me about that on this LP. So having said that, I think we'll stop off for real. Join me next time when I do that, that stuff that I said I would do. Ah, this bean, Kiss Blue, with Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network! And have a good day. Bye!